Welcome to Foam Week TV, hosted by SprayFoam.com. I'm Heather Westrell with this week's Spray Foam news from around the world. The second issue of the Spray Foam Insulation and Roofing magazine is now available. In just a couple of months, the premiere issue was viewed in over 74 countries and had over 65,000 pages read. This December issue takes a look at the benefits of open cell spray foam in addition to many other features. You can read it now at SprayFoamDigital.com or download the free iTunes and Android apps to read it on the go. High Efficiency Foam recently installed spray foam on the doors of a boatyard storage hangar in Harpswell, Maine. Due to the indoor setting of the job site, time needed to be spent preparing the area with overspray protection. The crew was then able to apply closed cell spray foam from scissor lifts on three different hangar doors. Finally, High Efficiency's team trimmed off the excess foam from the door framing, completing the job successfully in just three days. Coastal Insulation Corporation, in conjunction with Help USA and Make It Right Foundation, completed a spray foam application project for the Clinton Avenue Urban Renewal Project in Newark, New Jersey. Coastal Insulation was tasked to apply foam to nearly 56 units of rental housing, including computer rooms, a fitness center, meeting rooms, and a community service space. According to Coastal, spray foam was chosen because it provides unique benefits to the different types of areas and substrates involved with this project. Look for this complete story coming soon to sprayfoam.com. I'm Heather Westrell, and that's what's happening this week on Foam Week.